This case consider the issue of exclusion clauses and implied terms, and whether or not an exclusion clause could be implied into an oral contract for the transportation of a man's vehicle after the ship sank and his car was lost. In this case, a man entered into a contract for a company to transport his car on a ship. The ship sank due to the negligence of the owners of the ship, and so the man brought an action seeking damages for the loss of his car. The company, however, argued that they were exempted from liability on the basis that the contract contained an exclusion clause. However, the man argued that he had signed no contract 